We'll be attacking the goal to our left at the wall end here and a game starting three hours earlier as the Orlando Pride of the NWSL will play a little later this evening here in this stadium. Had to clear the space as their game moved up from the weekend due to the impending arrival of Hurricane Irma. Here's Troyer able to get a service in. Top of the box, one-time shot off to the left side. It's off target, but Thompson has the overlap on the left. Instead, will cross it towards the back post, headed down, then over the frame. There's a good chance for Haji Berry. John A, service across back post, headed and in. Mikey Minutello, his first goal of the season and first as a Richmond kicker. It's difficult when you allow a team to head the ball twice in the box. It's almost a percentage it's very high that the ball is going to go in, you know, because everybody is, is watching the first ball. The Bolduc or Jane, and he buries it. It is 2 0. His third goal of the season. And it has been a house of horrors here the last five minutes for OCB. Yeah, as we said before, it's, uh, you don't want to give teams opportunities like this one right on top of the box, especially with the quality of players that they have. We've seen the quality of the crosses that they put in the box created a lot. And now danger again, trying to chip the keeper. John A wasn't far away and only could uh, only Fenlison could watch. That's the only thing he could do. How about a lovely ball to... Zach Ellis Hayden keeps his feet, sends it across, tipped over the bar by Wara, who did well with it. It will be a corner kick for OCB. OCB is going to be out of time here. As soon as this goes in. Game, set, match. Triple blast of the whistle for Jonathan Belinsky, the referee, 2-0. To the Richmond Kickers, they make two set-piece goals in the last five minutes of the first half. Hold up. First road win of the season for Richmond. 